Hi students, welcome back to our science class. Today we are going to learn about characteristics of invertebrates. Again, characteristics of invertebrates. All right, read your vocabulary words two times. Okay, first, characteristic, characteristic. Hollow tubes, hollow tubes, tentacles, tentacles, spiny skin, spiny skin, segmented, segmented, unsegmented, unsegmented, feeding, feeding. Next. Soft body, soft body, round body, round body, flat body, flat body, thin, thin, external, external, skeleton, skeleton, exoskeleton. Exoskeleton, jointed legs, jointed legs, shields, shields. All right, look at the picture. These invertebrates are sponges. What are the characteristics of sponges? Sponges have hollow tubes with many pores. Okay, look at the pictures. Okay, these are hollow tubes. Right next, these invertebrates are cnidarians. Question: What are the characteristics of Nidarians. Right, read slowly. Nidarians have tentacles which are used in feeding. All right, look at the picture. Okay, these are the tentacles. Okay, next. Look at the picture again. These invertebrates are annelids. What are the characteristics of annelids? Okay, annelids are segmented worms. Okay, look at the picture. Okay, these are segments of annelids. Okay, next. These invertebrates are round worms. Right? What are the characteristics of round worms? Round worms are unsegmented worms. And they have thin and round bodies. Next, look at the picture. These invertebrates are flat worms. Okay, what are the characteristics of flat worms? Flat worms are unsegmented worms with soft and flat body. Right, next, look at the picture. These invertebrates are echinoderms. Question, what are the characteristics of echinoderms? All right, echinoderms have spiny skin, okay? Spiny skin. Look at the picture. This, 
ओके द स्किन इज स्पाइनी राइट नेक्स्ट लुक एट द पिक्चर अगेन दिस इन वर्टिब्रेट्स आर मोलास्ट क्वेश्चन what are the characteristics of mollusk right look at the picture mollusk are soft bodied and usually have shells okay this part this is a shell right next this invertebrates are arthropods what are the characteristics of arthropods okay read slowly arthropods have jointed legs and external skeleton called exoskeleton Okay, and look at the picture. This one. These are jointed legs. Okay, let's practice, students. Answer properly. Question. What are the characteristics of sponges? Okay, choose your answer. A or B? Okay, the answer is A. Very good. Sponges have hollow tubes. Okay, next. What are the characteristics of Niderians? Okay, what's your answer? I will give you five counts. One, two, three, four, five. All right, the answer is letter B. Niderians have tentacles. Okay. Next. What are the characteristics of annelids? Okay, choose your answer A or B. I will give you three counts. One, two, three. Very good. The answer is letter A. Annelids are segmented worms. Right, next. Look at the picture. What are the characteristics of echinoderms? Okay, what is your answer? A or B? I will give you three counts. One, two, three. All right, the answer is Letter B, echinoderms have spiny skin. All right, very good. Next, what are the characteristics of mollusk? Okay, what's your answer? A or B, I will give you three counts. One, two, three. Very good, the answer is Mollusk usually have shells. Very good. Okay, next. What are the characteristics of arthropods? What's your answer? A or B? I will give you three counts. One, two, three. All right, the answer is letter B. Arthropods have jointed legs. Very good. Okay, that's all for today, students. Don't forget to answer your worksheet. Hey, okay, thank you. See you again next time. Bye-bye.